Hello friends, in this lecture we will learn how to create a function model through BDC recording. So here for demo purpose, I'm taking example of VA02 transition code. And my requirement is, I want to change, update the delivery block in the sales order. <clears throat> so once you log into VA02 transition code by entering the sales order number, we have to go to this tab, this icon, display header details. And here in shipping, we need to update this delivery block. Either we can set any value from the drop down list or we can just make it blank. So this is the business requirement. And for this, I will do a BDC recording with transition code SHDB and then from that SHDB recording, we will learn how to create a function model. Most of the time, we create a program to update the bulk data. But sometimes for single transition update, sometimes we required to update something through the ALV report or through single like single input transition code. So in that case, once you know this concept, how to create a function model, we can make use of this. So now I will go to transition code SHDB, click on new recording. You can give any name for the recording, ZVA02 I'm giving here, and transition code, I want to record VA02. For demo, I'm taking this example VA02. Based on your requirement, you can use the suitable transition code. Enter. This is my order number. I press enter. We click on display header data, shipping tab, and currently here delivery block is blank. I will select any value. Let me select here like 07. And then I will click on save icon, save button. Now this is the BDC recording data. Again, I will click here on save. So what you have to do? See, my requirement is very clear. I will enter only the sales order number on the screen and I want to update only one value, this one, delivery block, VBAK, LIFSK. VBAK is a header table for sales order data. LIFSK is the delivery block field. So all the other fields, all the other fields, we have to delete from this recording. Only fields, not the BDC OK code or BDC service screen code. Okay, so on the first screen here, this is the sales order number, which I will pass as an input. So after this, this is the PO number I will delete. So all the fields which we don't want, we have to delete. Okay, sub screen, then this is customer ID. This, this also I will delete. This is some date field. All the unwanted data, which I'm not going to change. I don't want to change through my BDC program. I will delete all. Okay. So first this is done. This is BDC cursor or service screen. Then here, okay, code is slash T02. This means that I'm clicking on the shipping tab. Here also, again, I will click this BDC cursor we have to put set as it is. AU date, I'm going to delete. AU date. WER key, PR state, this field also I will delete. Row number 22, now I'll go to next step. And before save, here I'm entering the delivery block, either ID or blank, I will delete this last one. Okay, so like this, from this recording, we have to delete all the fields which we, do, which, which we don't require. And by mistake, if any field is there, no issue, we can comment that in the function module. Okay, so only two input for this recording, sales order number and this delivery block. I will save this, come back. This is the latest one. So to create a function model, first we have to create a function group. A function group is a container for function model. So for that, I will go to transition code AC80. Give any function group name here. Here I'm giving ZSD 
fgv1 do you want to create this function uh, this object yes function group for sd save in a package create a tr like fm through bdc recording okay and once this function group is created you have to right click here and first thing activate the function group the function group is activated now so now again i will go back to this shdb recording and we have to click first you have to select this recording and click on this create function module see the function module name you can give any name here set va02 delivery block v1 my function group name z sd underscore fg v1 okay and here i will write set reset delivery block set reset let's say sales order delivery block fine so we can set or reset you can also make the blank so once we enter here, you can see the function module block has been created. Okay, go back and now enter transition code SC37. This is the function module we created. Just open in display mode. Attribute here, you can see by default system has created this RFC, remote enable function module. In the importing parameter, you can see this default CTU mode like A, E, A means system display all the screen and is like a background mode. We can and pass E for error mode, update, group, etc. Okay, so here you can see only two input fields we have. Only two fields we need to pass VBLN and the delivery block ID. Exporting, changing, and in tables, we'll get the message type. Whenever we do the BDC recording, we get all the messages in BDC message, right? That will get in this tab, this source code. Let me execute this. So now I will open the same uh, self order in zero, uh, VA03 display mode. So currently the delivery block here is 07. So let me try to update from here. So let's see how this will work in the A mode. I'm changing this to A mode, okay? and I will pass here 53. If I execute this function module, see, now this is working in a display mode. You can see all the screen. This is the initial screen, press enter. Now system will click on head tab. Now system will click on the second tab shipping. So here the delivery block, we can see only this is in red. Means this value we are passing this value we are passing from input. And now system will click on save button. So now we can see the order is saved. In the message tab, we can see the messages, output message. Okay. And here size of RC, we can see zero. Okay. So now let me again set here and that is background mode. This is 07. If again, if I enter, we can see here 53. Okay, this is working fine. Now let's see how this works in the end mode, background mode. Again, 7 50, instead of 53, again, I will make it 7. Execute. See, size of RC equal to 0. Go back. Shipping. 07 fine so in this way in a very short time we can create a function model through the bdc recording fine so in the next lecture what i will do i will create a small program and we will pass we will pass this vbeln and lifsk to the program okay so in this way we will learn how to do the bdc recording with shdb transition code and how to create a function model using that recording Next lecture, we'll create a small web program. Thank you.